Two of them left over there. Yeah, yeah. I think I'll. Uh, I think I might just. I'll drop these bombs nose down and then get myself killed. Because what's a Catalina going to do in a domination mission? I mean, seriously. Tally ho, chaps. Light AA guns. Uh, waste of time. <laughs> See what I mean? <laughs> Screw this. Let's go. Let's go and capture an airstrip. Can we do that? Yeah, let's do that. Jesus, look at that year two. What tier is he? Is he tier? I think he's tier 11, you know. <laughs> I'm in my tier ones and zeros. Well, this should be fun. Let's get this ground column. I can drop a bomb on something. There go my gunners. Well, my gunners are pretty good. And a Catalina can take a punishment. Who that shooting at me? Oh Christ, the stern of it. Okay, my gunners aren't that good. Let's get rid of these bombs. Turn inside him. Yeah. And you would be surprised at that battering Catalina can take. <laughs> We're hitting that sturdily. Oh, zone captured. <laughs> Loads of lovely XP. <laughs> Look at these guys crashing trying to kill me. <laughs> I love this game, and I'm so incredibly slow. They're all overshooting. Tier one aircraft in a tier seven game, and just look. <laughs> oh, I love this game. Oh, look how slow I am. They're all overshooting. My gunners are ripping them apart. Look at the battering this thing can take. I land again. I don't think I'm going to make it. I'm not. Controls are shot. There we go. <laughs> that was fun. Here's a little something I thought was worth sharing with YouTube. I'm flying uh, an Ishak. It's a rank 2 Russian uh, monoplane fighter. Six rockets under the wings, four machine guns. And my target, I have spotted an SB2 level bomber. Note that the SP-2 is not a dive bomber, it's not a ground attack aircraft, it's a medium twin-engined bomber. It's got two gun turrets, and that's pretty much it. Um, you know what, I'm, I'm, I'm not even going to comment on this, I'll just, just draw your own conclusions as to how utterly retarded that thing's flight model is.
Yep. Outmaneuvered by a bloody level bomb. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Oh shit. <laughs> Stalingrad domination with the Japanese. And I have two very big and very useless Japanese bombers. Still, there's one thing Japanese fighters are very, very good at, and that's domin um, domination. Yeah, dogfighting. So, we should be able to get some decent kills here. Only problem is they're very, very fragile. Historically, the Mitsubishi Zero managed to be so manoeuvrable and fast because, um, well, it had absolutely no protection. It didn't have self-sealing fuel tanks. There was no armor around the cockpit for the pilot. They sacrificed a lot to keep the speed and maneuverability up and the weight down. So, I, I'm not entirely certain it's modeled completely accurately in arcade battles, but they do feel very, very, very fragile. You get your first proper zero at rank seven in the Japanese Air Force, and it's it's really good. Two 20 millimeter cannons and two crappy machine guns. It's not bad. It's a really good dogfighter. So I'm going to take. The zero out first. There it is. The Mitsubishi A6M20. And it seemed to be the furthest one ahead. I really want to be the one going for. Oh. F4 also going for it, and he's faster than me in the dive. Possibly too fast, we shall see. Going to start shedding speed now. Increase drag with the rudder. Oh, an A20G. That could be nasty. I might make it. He's coming in fast though. Oh, I really want to get chewed up on the runway with his machine guns. There we go. Zone captured. Get the hell out of here. on the runway in a domination mission. You must be new here. Well, let's see what this is. Danke schön. Right. Enemy team are fighting hard over B. And they've got it. Remember, never be the first in. You just end up with six planes leaping on your tail. Be the second one in. Jump on the tail of the six planes leaping on the tail of the first one in. What's PE2 doing? I don't know, but I'm going to have him. Oh, it looks like he's trying to cap. Speed and maneuverability now. But. Yeah, we're losing this one pretty badly. Well, I'll just do the best we can. Get some speed up. I'm throwing all of my advantages at what they're pushing really hard for A. Oh, God. Might they don't capture it. Alright, we're on my speed's low. Hurricane's going for it. Covering. HE 111H up here. Well, I'm 
hit him. Come on, Jingles, you gotta do better than that. Cannons reloading, 22 seconds. We've totally lost this one. They're on a Wellington gunner. Now my cannon back up, and while his tail in it, he's occupied with that fella. Hit him. Got him. Ah, I don't like the way I'm being forced to stay at low speed all the way around here. He's in the sun, but I can still see him. There he is. Come on, cannons. Yeah, that was a horrible defeat. But, didn't lose any aircraft. So that one didn't actually cost me anything. Enemy team were all over us. It was all I could do just to defend the airbase. And, yeah. Well, <laughs> because it was over so fast, nobody got a decent score. Um, yeah. Yeah, not too bad. But uh, at least it was a you know it was a good run out for the zero. Well, I, it wasn't even a good run out for the zero because I was forced to stay so low and be turning constantly so tight, just swatting attacks off from the airbase that I couldn't really show you the speed and maneuverability of this little thing. So that was a bit crap.